Welcome to a general overview video for Easy Badges software. Easy Badges is going to be compatible with both Mac and PC and work with all major card printer models from Zebra, Fargo, MagicCard, and Evolus. Easy Badges is a one time purchase with no recurring fees. Free lifetime phone and email support is also included with your purchase. If you're ever having trouble trying to print, don't hesitate to reach out. This video is going to be about the basics of designing a card. So let's get started by selecting the option here on the left, start using Easy Badges and create your new card, and select this option right here, create a card yourself. This is going to open up the card types window. It's the best to keep this drop down menu here on common card types because most card printers are only going to be capable of printing on this CR80 size card. CR80 is going to be the same size as a debit card or a driver's license. You can change your card orientation between portrait and landscape mode by pressing this check mark here at the bottom left corner. So I'm going to select the CR80 card and press OK. And this is going to open up my basic card editing window. On the left hand side of the screen, are objects you can add to your card like text boxes, images, and barcodes. And on the right hand side of the screen are menus to edit the attributes about the objects. So for example, I'm going to click on my text box tool. It changes my cursor and I'm going to click and drag where I want my text to be. And say, let's have a text box for first name and a text box for last name. You have a couple different options at your disposal to add images to your cards and easy badges. You can use the browse image tool here on the left. If you click browse image and then click and drag where you want your image to go, it will prompt you to select where your image is saved. So I'm just going to select easy badges here and open it up. Another option you have to upload photos to your cards is to simply drag and drop them onto the card. If you know where the photo is saved on your computer, just drag and drop it onto the card and it will upload straight to the program. With the beginner version of Easy Badges, you have the ability to add standard 2D barcodes to your card. So let's use the card back option up here and flip our card around and add a barcode to the back of our card. I'm going to select the new barcode tool, click and drag where I want that barcode to go. And I'm going to double click on the barcode and update the information in the please enter barcode data box and then click off the barcode and this will save the changes. Let's add a few more objects to our card to get it ready for print. Let's use the rectangle tool on the left to split up the objects here and let's add a placeholder image and another barcode to the front and when we're ready to print we can select the printer icon at the top left here. Make sure that the printer you want to print to is selected in the drop down menu here and if you are printing double sided, both print front and print back are selected. So when your card is ready to go, go ahead and hit print. The beginner version of Easy Badges has the ability to create an internal database for your cards. You can select the first and last name and any variable information field and make it so it changes after each print. For some more information on this, refer to our database connection video. That about covers it for all of the basic steps to get a badge designed. If you have any questions about the process, feel free to give us a call. We're happy to help you out. Or feel free to reach out to us at our support email, support at easybadges.com.